Hi guys, so sorry, stupid camera. It had three on there and it can't take four. The SD card was full again um, and I didn't realise. It used to take more than that. I don't know why it's not, but there you go. Right, I don't know where it cut off, but what I did was a fine layer of cold grey three. Then I went to the darkest one, which was the Payne's Grey. And then I went to the Cold Grey V1. And that one is what I am blending in the dark um, to the rest of it. I'm just very lightly going over to blend it in together. Um, just where the dark has been just so it doesn't look so um, sort of stark on its own um, and I have noticed um, that since I've been doing this Anastasia series that I've lost quite a lot of subscribers um, I don't know why um, perhaps you didn't like this series um, if so, tell me what you would like to see um, and we can do that. Um, but um, I, I, I know I haven't been in streams lately and I haven't been, you know, in people's streams chatting um, like I used to. But like I said, you know, I hope you'll all understand that with Zach at the moment, we never know when he's going to kick off um, and I don't like joining a stream and then not being able to join in because something is going on um, you know around me and stuff um, it, it's just really difficult here at the minute I'm trying to get stuff done slowly to get the craft room sorted out um, so where I can stream more often and better and not have um, to do it on the kitchen table as I am now um, and when Zach's gone it will be so much easier as well because I will have you know the peace and quiet to to do stuff um, without having him interrupt or have the worry about him starting to kick off because him and Tim have disagreed about something or other um so i'm really sorry if you don't like my channel but um you know um it is what it is i'm afraid um i know life is difficult for a lot of us who who do coloring and that's why we color because it it relaxes us and keeps us calm um so i know that you know that a lot of you will understand the trouble that I'm having at the moment um, for those of you that don't understand well I'm sorry I, you know there's not much I can do about that um, I'm doing my best the best I can um, I'm trying to watch as many videos as I can I still am watching people even though you know it's after the live stream um, and I'm trying to, I mean, even if I don't leave a comment, I do add a like to yours channel. Um, all the people that I used to, you know, join in with, um, I am still watching you. Um, so if you decide you don't want to watch me anymore, then so be it. Um, that's entirely up to you, but... My life is what it is at the moment. I can't change that. Um, so, you know, um, I just think if you've, you know, unsubscribed from me because I don't come to your live streams anymore or leave a comment, you know, on your um, channel anymore, I just think it's a bit mean of you. But it is what it is you know and if you don't like it then too bad um, I 
don't know why I had more subscribers and uh, quite a lot of you have left um, since I've been doing this picture. What it is about this picture, I, you know, just made you leave, I don't know. Um, but, you know, it's your choice. Um, I still class people who I used to speak to on there as friends. Um, I wouldn't unsubscribe from any of you. Um, but it is what it is. So I've done the dark where the dark is and I've just sort of blended it in a bit with um, cold grey V1. Um, right, now I'm going to just go over with cold grey 1 and I'm going to do that sort of all over and that's just really to blend things together because as most of you will know that cold that not cold um light colors um will blend things in together um better than you know than a white or whatever if you're using the same color but a lighter color it will help to blend it all in so I'm just going to go over with that to help blend that in. Now I have taken all the videos off of the SD card that were on there um, from today and I have changed the battery. So we really shouldn't have too much problem um, getting this finished now. Um, I'm not far off finishing I'm just sort of going to go where the dark is as well to blend it all in together um, I'm probably not um, as thorough as what some people are but the um, the amount of problems I've had with this camera trying to do this picture has been so annoying for me. Um, whether that's why people have left, I don't know. But, you know, it's something that's out of my control, something that I've never come across before, something I'm learning that I now can't have, you know, any more on there then say three um because it doesn't like it so um we we ha don't have a lot of choice or i don't have a lot of choice um but to film with this camcorder i have nothing else to film with at the minute so that's that's how it is guys um if you don't like it then you know, fine. There's not a lot else I can do at the minute. I haven't got the money to, you know, go and buy a new camera or anything. Um, so really, I'm sort of stuck. Um, I would like a camcorder that would take longer, would film longer than 43 minutes. And I would like one that would... Um, not keep cutting out, take, um, I know I really need a bigger SD card, um, I thought that was big enough, it's a 64 gigabyte, so it should really take more, but it's not, um, I was so looking forward to doing this picture, but because of all the problems I've had with the camera with this, it's really sort of put me off at the minute um basically i just want to get this sort of finished now i don't want to leave it unfinished and or finish it off camera and because some of you might have been following along or um so we'll see um how it is um 
I'm not going to be too thorough with that. I'm quite happy with how it is at the minute. <clears throat> so I'm going to go in with my black. And I'm just going to go lightly where the um, shadows are. Just very lightly. The cats are going to start fighting now. Oh, it's Dylan. Hi, Dylan. So it came up to about there. Just to darken up, really, these shadows because I want them to look um, as if they are sort of deep. Um, so I want to make them sort of look a bit darker. Um, I want to make them sort of look deep so the other bits stand out more, if you know what I mean. Um, so this is nearly all shadow there. Um, start this end although I'm, I'm a bit hot because it's, it's quite warm in here but it's quite chilly outside now. Um, I just stood at the back door and it's quite chilly out there. Um, although it's still warm in here, this house gets terribly warm um, and obviously with indoor cats we can't have the windows open too wide. Um, one time Lily did um, realise that the windows um, were open and she found out that if she pushed it then she could get out. Um, we thought we'd lost her because she's not straight wise obviously not been out before um, and Zach found her a couple of streets away underneath a car. So we now have to be really, really careful and we can only have certain windows open. Um, we don't have the windows open in the living room um, because they sit on the windowsill there and look out the window a lot. So then windows we keep shut. Um, so because obviously they then realise that they can get out of them ones. So we keep them ones shut. We have sort of like the... Um, landing, top of landing one, um, we have that one open, we can't get out there, and we have the hall one open, um, we can't get out there, and we have the kitchen window above the sink open, because they never go above the sink, so um, we can have them one sort of just open, a, you know, a couple of inches. Um, which is just enough to let some air through and then we've got fans going as well so but in the kitchen obviously there isn't any fans um, and it's now night time because of all this messing about with this silly camera um, it's now night time so um, it is so sort of dark out there so I don't really want the window open too much because it lets all the moths in and things so I've got pencil stuck to my arm as usual <laughs> which is what happens around here and when I get too hot the pencils all stick to my arms which is a real pain when you've got pencils out and you're colouring away and then you get them all stuck to your arms so this is how it's going to sort of look. Um, so I just thought I would deepen it up with the black. Didn't want to do the black straight away because black sometimes is too much and it's like a um, is the last colour that you use because it's one colour that you know you can't erase. Um, very well so it's really a last resort so I didn't go in with the black straight away um, I thought I would just do the grey and then sort of see um, 
if we needed to darken it up and I think we do so these are just the parts that Anastasia has um, put her mark on um, she's put like some marks there so it means you know that that there's a shadow there so that's why these are so easy these pictures that she does because she puts all the shadows and the highlights and everything in for you so really you're just following her lead really um, of what she of what she's already you know put in there for you um, so it makes it so so easy for to, to do these pictures um, I'm not being very careful here I think I'm just sort of at the stage where I just want this finished now um, this the camera has just been such a pain on this picture it's like is it, it's like it's jinxed or something this picture um, you know it's just been such a pain in the bum um, but I'm just sort of, I really love this picture, it's the, my favourite one in the book, um, but I've sort of, um, I've lost sort of, um, I don't know what the word is, I've lost my mojo for this picture now, to be honest, but I'm still liking it. I mean, we're just about done anyway, there's not much more to do. Um, so this is just going to be dark and dark, that's all. Um, and it's just making it just a few shadows and that where it would be darker naturally. And that's all we're doing. And I think that's okay. Right, I'm going to use my cold grey 1B and I'm going to do these bits of jewellery on her. Do these circles. And then around these bits. I probably will put some Posca pen on them so they've got a bit of shine on them. Um, but I'll probably do that off camera and you'll see the picture on my completed pictures at the end of the month. So yeah I think I was so enjoying doing this picture but I think all the stopping and starting and hassles I've had with this camera with this picture it's just I lost my mojo for it. Um, it's nobody's fault, you know. It's just, just me being a dumbass. I mean, I've not had the problem before ever, where the SD card has said that it's full, um, and I've put lots on before, so I don't understand why I can only put like three on um, before it stops and just make sure it's still going yes it is 18 minutes so yeah I don't understand what's going on um, we'll just do her necklace there we won't do individual beads or whatever chain that is um, I'm just going to go across it um, and not I'm not gonna you know go do it round each one or whatever. Um, I might even go over that with um, silver gel pen maybe just to make it stand out a bit and also around the other bits but I'll see. Um, right what didn't we do? We didn't do our eyebrows did we so I've got a brown and we're going to just Flick her eyebrows there in brown. So 
So that's them done. And her lips I decided to do. I'm gonna do darkest bit like in the middle and some around the outside and like her lips at the top there. Um, lines and then I'm going to do madder this one was, what was that one? magenta and this one is madder so I'm just going to colour that in but I'm going to leave a tiny bit for highlights so she's sort of got reddish purplish lipstick in there I'm going to leave a tiny bit of highlight on there as well um, so we'll colour that in and just put it there and I'm going to leave a tiny bit there for a highlight on her lips it might be a bit too big actually a bit more around so it's not so quite so much um, that's a bit better um, and then I can do her eyelashes as well I'll go round her eye and then I'm going to flick her eyelashes Do her nostril a bit dark there. And I think that's it, guys. Um, I don't think there's anything else we need to do, is there? So we've done her jewellery, we've done her lipstick, and we've done eyelashes. Yeah, and I'm happy with the window. You can see sort of, you know, darker patches and where the stonework goes in and out and things so yeah I'm quite happy with that seeing all the problems that we've had with filming and things um, I'm quite happy with that I probably will go around the edge of the dress there on the very edge line with the white Posca which I haven't got on me at the minute um, and a jewellery I'll probably do with some glitter gel pen um, and apart from that that's all I'm going to do, I think. Um, don't think there's anything much else I can do. So, yeah, that's it, guys. We're finished. Um, hope you enjoyed this series. Um, if you didn't, let me know what you'd like to see. Um, I'm happy to colour anything that I have in my collection. Um, just ask me if I have a certain thing. Um, and I'm happy to do that for you. Um, September will be September Rain. That's spelt R-A-E-N. And on Etsy she goes under Rain Printing. Um, and it can be anything from any of her books or her single PDFs. Um, so that's what we're going to be doing in September. I am going to be doing more from this book as well. Um, and Mysteria. I've got one on the go in Mysteria at the moment. Um, so that's it guys and I'll show you at the end of the month exactly what she looks like with a bit of Posca and a bit of glitter. So hope you enjoyed the series guys. If not, tell me down below what you'd like to see. Thanks guys. Thanks for joining. Bye.